Hi, I'm Timothy Brissella, and we're doing a little business calculus today with my Math 1325 class. Here's the problem. They give us a graph. They ask us to list the intervals on which the function is increasing, the intervals on which it's decreasing, and the location of all local extrema. When I look at this function, when I look at this graph here, I see that the graph is rising from left to right. It looks like this, for, for one thing, this graph looks like a parabola. The graph is rising from left to right. Out here on this interval, the graph is rising from left to right. So it's increasing. And where is it increasing? Uh, it starts at 6 on the x-axis, and it goes on out. So it's increasing on the open interval from 6 to infinity. decreasing that means the graph is falling from left to right you're looking from left to right don't let the fact that those arrows keep going up make you think it's increasing it is not when you look from left to right from left to right the graph is falling so out here all out there it's decreasing so from negative infinity up to six on the x-axis the y coordinate, uh, the y coordinates are getting smaller and smaller. The graph is falling from left to right. Do we have a local maximum? A local maximum occurs when the function is increasing. A local maximum that occurs when the function is increasing and then it changes to decreasing. A local minimum occurs when the function is decreasing and then it changes to increasing. I'll tell you this much, we have one of them, a local maximum or a local minimum, which one? Minimum. A local minimum, I agree. The function is decreasing, it reaches a low point there relative to all the points around it, then it starts to increase. So I agree with a local minimum of what is that minimum uh, value and what is the x value that corresponds to it? Looking there at that low point, what's the x value? Six, I agree. You oh, I did circle maximum, didn't I? Thanks for pointing that out. There. There, I'm going to mark that out. And I circle minimum. I'll use a different color. You could think they would put it in alphabetical order, but obviously they didn't. So <coughs> it occurred at an x value of six. What's the y value at that point? Six, it's hard to tell. What is that y coordinate? Negative, I think it's a negative one. I think it's a negative one. Okay. I think that's at a, uh, the y value is negative one when x is equal to six. Any questions there? 